Hey guys, I just got out of the supermarket. Um, I bought everything we need to make pastelillos. So I'm gonna start the process at home, um, just like prepping, and then tomorrow my cousin's gonna come over and help me. So you guys get to join us on this pastelillo journey. Hola friends, we're here today. We're going to be making pastelillos, which is basically a Puerto Rican empanada. I have my cousin here. She doesn't want to be on camera, but if you see extra hands, that's who's helping behind the scenes. We are starting to cook the meat. So the recipe is not mine, so I'm not going to be sharing the recipe through this video, um, but I will show you parts of the process of what we're doing because making pastelillos, again, is just like a basic cooking experience. It's not anything particular or secret to anybody. Um, and then obviously we will try them, we will eat them, we will chat. So see you soon. done it looks and smells delicious we are moving on to good photoshop okay we are moving on to um putting them in the discos so this is basically just like dough this is not good for you but it tastes delicious so we're gonna put meat in the big ones we'll put cheese in the little ones and we'll show you how we're doing the folding all right so here's my sad attempt to try and do the pinch and fold which my friend vicente taught me about three years ago haven't done it since but here we go so we're gonna pinch and fold pinch and fold. Oh boy. <laughs> Not too bad. Pinch and fold. Oh, hey, wait a second. This actually doesn't look too bad. Getting kind of like a braided edge look. This keeps everything secure inside. Wait, this looks wrong. <laughs> Pinch and fold. Oh, the endings of some of these are a little dry. Just gotta be careful. Oh my goodness gracious. This is like a seven. This this side gets a ten, the rest gets a seven. Oof, or a four. Alright, here it is. It's my pastelillo. Alright, so we've got one going over here in the canola oil, frying away nicely. The rest, my cousin brought her air fryer, so we're being fancy. So we'll see how these turn out as compared to these. It's all the same stuff, but just a different method of cooking. Woohoo! We have small discos, so we did the big discos, we did the meat, and for the small ones we're going to be doing queso. So I'm just going to sprinkle some of this in the middle. Um, you obviously could like do your own, grate your own cheese, any kinds you wanted, but I thought it would be easier to just get a package. Here we go. Fold, pinch and fold. Is this for your kids? Yes. Everything I do is for my kids. <laughs> Karma. Them. No pastelillos para ti. We have an air bubble that's trying to get away from us. So we have two sets of pastelillos. We're gonna, this is the fried plate and this is the air fried. Try one of both, but I'm gonna start with one of these. Looks super delish. Oh my goodness. Mmm. Wow. I'll give it a 10. That's really good. A little bit. This probably has meat and cheese in it, or just cheese. <laughs> it's definitely different. It's good, but like definitely the way it's cooked is different. But also delicious. This is a cheese one. 
All right, so we're gonna sit and we're gonna feast and I'll see you guys next time.